You know, Emerald was a registrational trial. It took treatment experience patients, so they were on a stable regimen, boosted PI along with TDF and FTC. It was a rather large trial, over 1,100, about 1,150 patients. What was unique really is that in regards to these usual switch, switch trials where you take stable patients, virologically suppressed, usually in their background, they've always been virologically suppressed. They've always actually taken their medications reli reliably. No prior virologic failures uh, in, in some of these trials uh, have been allowed. This one actually took patients that perhaps had those prior failures. Per, were perhaps vulnerable to, to lapses in adherence. About 15% of these patients actually had prior ARV failures and about 7% had prior PI failures. The caveat was that they couldn't have a prior darunavir failure. So these patients were coming in with prior genotypes uh, that showed no darunavir resistance. However, they could have had, again, prior failures to other resistance and actually a multiplication of ARVs in their history. These patients were diagnosed on meeting about nine years before entry into the trial. They'd been started on uh, ART about six years uh, prior to entry into the trial. So they were a fairly heavily treatment experienced patients. Uh, about 58% of them uh, had multiple regimens uh, before their stable regimen with FTC TDF boosted Darunavir coming into the trial. And about 25% had at least seven or more uh, ARVs uh, in their background. So a heavily treated uh, experienced patient population that may have had prior resistance, which could speak to prior problems with adherence.